Welcome to the MBS Engineering channel. Today, we will be discussing how to calculate the safe working load, or SWL, for D shackle materials. We will cover the following topics in the upcoming slides. Next, we learn about how to calculate the safe working load, or SWL, for D shackle materials. Two methods to determine the safe working load, SWL, of the D shackle. The first method is quite simple. The safe working load, or SWL, is usually written on the D shackle. Next, the second method you can calculate the safe working load, or SWL, by using the formula. First, we learn how to understand the safe working load by using the D-shack materials. You can refer to the snaps of the D-shackle to see the safe working load written over it. Please refer to the snaps. On a small D-shackle, the safe working load capacity of 1 ton is written. Next, please refer to the snaps. On a big D-shackle, the safe working load capacity of 1.5 ton is written. Next, we learn how to calculate the safe working load, or SWL for D shackle materials. The second method is to calculate the safe working load, or SWL, by using a formula. If you know the diameter of the D shackle in inches, you can use the following formula to determine its safe working load. Next, safe working load, SWL, is equals to 8 into D into D. For example, to calculate the safe working load, SWL, of a 1 inch, and 7 divided by 8 inch diameter D shackle, you need to. First, we understand the safe working load capacity of the 1 inch diameter D shackle. For 1 inch diameter, safe working load, SWL, is equals to 8 into 1 into 1. Safe working load for 1 inch diameter D shackle is equals to 8 ton. Next, we understand the safe working load capacity of the 7 divided by 8 inch diameter D shackle. For 7 divided by 8 inch diameter, safe working load, SWL, is equals to 8 into, 7 divided by 8, into, 7 divided by 8. Therefore, the safe working load, SWL, is equals to 6.125 ton. We hope this video has helped you understand how to calculate the safe working load, SWL, of D shackle materials. If you have any questions, please feel free to let us know in the comments section. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more informative videos. Thank you for watching.